Hi, this is Robin with On The Pulse Investing, ready to help you change your future. This video is to show you step-by-step -step how to register for a free brokerage account with Ditto Trade. From there, you will be able to duplicate our trades and experience real growth for your hard-earned savings. Once you click on either our link to the Ditto landing page right from our website, or simply go to www.dittotrade.com, you will see a page similar to this one or this one. Click Open a New Account if you have not done so already. Fill out your name, email, and give yourself a username and password. Then click Next. This will take you to Step 1, Account Holder Information. First, you will choose who to follow. Type in Number 1, Pulse Investing. Then select your account type, such as Individual. Next, enter your address and scroll down to enter your phone number, and then click Next. Step 2, Financial Information. Enter your Social Security number, as it is required to hold a brokerage account in the United States now, your date of birth, citizenship, employment status, such as retired or self-employed, and your annual income followed by your net worth. Don't worry if these numbers are not exactly perfect. This is just for their initial records. Click Next. Step 3. Trading Preferences. The first question deals with whether you are employed as a broker-dealer or by FINRA. For most of you, this will be no. The next question refers to whether you own more than 10% of shares in a publicly traded company. Probably no. Next is your objective for your account, and while it does not have to match ours, our objective is growth, so we suggest selecting that option. Next is your investment experience, and don't worry, these answers can all be none or zero. Don't worry if you have no experience, that's what we're here for. Next is margin and options. We suggest no on margin, and we do not trade options, so this would also be no unless you trade yourself, and then you can answer yes or no on the disclosure question and check the approval box after you've read the terms and then click next. Step 4. Verify information. Simply view this and make sure there aren't any errors. If so, go back and change them and then click confirm verification. Step 5. Document signatures. Here you can check and agree to sign this electronically or you can be sent a hard copy to sign and send back. Then agree to the terms and conditions and click next. There's also a PDF available if you wish to print them for your records. Step 6. Security questions. Here you will have random questions that may or may not apply to you regarding automobiles or property that you may have owned or lived in, etc. Answer them to the best of your knowledge and click Next. If you happen to get this screen, not to worry. Simply take a picture of your ID or license and email it over to them to get your account set up and approved. Sometimes the online verification process it just is not complete. Once you get a confirmation that your new username is valid, return to the Ditto Trade homepage and enter it at the top along with your password to log in. When you log in, you should see a screen like this under My Account that shows your balance, account number, and options to the left for your dashboard, etc. Now it's time to fund your account. You can do this by clicking the Fund Your Account button to the right. You can do an ACH, an ACAT, or send a check. Congratulations! Your account is active and you are well on your way to investing in your future. In the next video, I will show you how to set an ACH transfer.